All right, we got a couple things to talk about, all right? So first things first, I, I respect, you know, the callback to Advanced Warfare uh, with this new uh, store pack that they got out for Ethan. Uh, now, I never played uh, Infinite Warfare, but I do understand that Ethan was an important character to the point where he was loved by the community. So that's why they're, you know, calling it back. Now, of course, this guy is not a fucking robot, all right? But it is a person that, you know, is somewhat similar to what Ethan used to look like. Which I respect. That's cool and all that. And they got the little charm, which is cool. Other than that, they got uh, this new pack, Fuerzas Especiales. I probably butchered the shit out of that. I don't give a fuck. Honestly, it looked kind of fucking cool. I would actually cop this. Especially since Mexico just lost. You know, that would be cool to have uh, another operator on the other team along with Messi as my other operator. World Cup shit, bro. Like, this, these games are fucking insane. Like, today's match with Japan and uh, I think... I think it was Japan and Spain today. That's fucking ridiculous. Like, I what was it? Spain was leading 1-0 at the half. And I was like, bro, really? Like, especially with all these, like, memes going around with, like, the blue lock shit. Like, I honestly thought, all right, this is where the memes end. Like, you know, that's just what's going to happen. But these motherfuckers came back with a vengeance. It is, it is insane how they came back. Like, those goals that they scored. First of all, that last goal... I don't know how the fuck he got it through all those people. That's props to that fucking guy. I don't even know his name, but props to him. One of the important things I have to talk about, right? So uh, obviously we, we've known about Microsoft acquiring, well, trying to buy out Activision to own. The purpose for that was to have Activision games on Game Pass. Now, this would, of course, mean that Call of Duty would be on Game Pass. Uh, games like Guitar Hero, which is what I'm hoping to play once it comes out i'm hoping for that to come out because bro like i don't know if some people realize this but guitar hero is old as shit and some of this some of these new gen players don't even understand how good of a game guitar hero is it's so simple as a, a beat game that they don't even realize like just listening to the actual music is just so fucking good like guitar hero aerosmith was my favorite fucking guitar hero game you know, of course, you have your people going to, like, Guitar Hero 2, Guitar Hero 3, Heroes of Rock. But Guitar Hero Aerosmith, that's me right there, baby. I don't know what the situation is with them acquiring Activision. Because I know that they try to buy it out, but I think they're going to court right now. Uh, for some dumb shit. I don't know. I just, I just know that they're going to court. I just hope whatever it is, it gets settled quickly. Because I would love to see Guitar Hero in a video. Like, honestly, wait. Now that I think about it. Can I even record Guitar Hero in a video? Like, how would that even go? Like, because I know there would be a bunch of copyright issues going on. There's no, there's no way that they would just let me, like, slide uploading copyrighted music from, like, 60 years ago, right? I'm actually supposed to be, like, taking care of my brother right now. Like, me and him are literally by ourselves and he's on, like, the other side of the fucking house. I'm, it's so irresponsible of me to be doing, but hey, man, th these, this YouTube grind. <laughs> These videos ain't gonna upload themselves. He'll be fine. If he gets hurt, he'll learn his lesson. Oh yeah, yesterday I got like 360 quick scoped in that market map yesterday, and I felt so fucking embarrassed. I literally like had to watch it over because I was like, damn, how the fuck did he kill me that quick? Cause I saw his body like flail or some shit. So I was like, oh, he just snapped to me mad quick. But once I saw it and went like I was astounded. I need to give his props or something. Like here, I'll I'll, I'll show you it right now. What the fuck? Nah, but yo, on, on my mama, yo, try that shit, bro. What the fuck? Another thing that I have to talk about is a character from Bleach, right? So we all know how Bleach is getting its thousand year blood war arc animated right now, and that shit's fucking sexy as hell. No pun intended, like, it's really good. Like, if you guys are into anime and haven't watched Bleach, catch up, bro. Go watch Thousand Year Blood War arc. That. But before we get off topic, I want to just address something how I've been seeing on TikTok. People are actually talking about a specific character. Now, no hate to this character or anything, right? Because honestly, I don't give a fuck about this character. Now, of course, if they die, you know, I'd be kind of sad. Besides that, the love that they're getting right now feels very fake. Feels very, uh, feels like there's like a second motive to it. So I'm talking about Soy Phone. Right? Soy Phone is a character that has been memed 
in Bleach for a while now. Specifically for the reason that, one, she's part of the stealth squad and her Bankai is a literal fucking nuke. Other than just that, she also gets memed mainly for the fact that she's just useless as a captain. Every fight that she's in, she has lost. There is not a moment in history except for the fight with Yoruichi where she kind of almost wins, but they kind of fake us out into basically saying that she was just toying with her the whole time. That's where we just noticed that she has a lot to learn as a character, and that's okay, but it's the fact that she tries to act like she's this big bad character when she's really not, and people hated her for it. Now, I specifically remember being in my... I remember specifically being in my advertising and marketing class where people were just slandering her for like day in, day out. I remember right before the Thousand Year Blood War arc was like announced or quote unquote leaked. I remember people were just slandering her every fucking day. Any post about her was slander. I never saw anybody even complimenting her just once. It was like I would have fucking offed myself if I was getting the hate that she was getting at that time. But all of a sudden, now that the Blood War arc is animated, there are people actually making, like, thirst traps about her, some kind of, like, edits where they're basically, like, glorifying her. Now, ain't nothing wrong with that. My issue is, what what's the change of opinion all of a sudden? She hasn't done anything so far in the series. She hasn't done anything in the series to be worthwhile so far in Blood War arc, and people are just simping over her. Like, it makes no sense. Like, someone, someone educate me. Now, going off of that, I fucking love my characters. Like, Ichigo was putting in that work until he got fucking body slammed by Yuobak, however you pronounce his name. I honestly, I can't. I, I don't even want to keep talking about it because, like, until more shit comes out, like, there's just nothing else to talk about. Like, I'm just left speechless after every episode. Now, speaking of speechless every episode, Chainsaw Man, what the fuck is going on? Like, we went from Denji literally getting groomed by two pedophiles and getting his first kiss to everybody that he's known so far and made friends with getting shot in the fucking head people f like uh I, I forgot her fucking name because i can't even think of it right now the one with the contract with the ghost devil she literally fucking died she, all that was left of her was her fucking eye patch and clothing fucking aki is getting dogged right now by whoever this fucking sword guy is in this random ass bitch with the yellow hair I have no idea what the fuck is going on. All I know is, is that people are like, this is where the real Chainsaw Man starts. I don't know what that means. But I'm scared. What the, what is going to, what is, what else is going to happen that's going to be better than what has already happened? Like, we've already seen like three firefights. We saw fucking Denji get them out the hotel. We saw him fight the Bat Devil. The chick that was kind of was with the Bat Devil. And we saw him fight the Zombie Devil. How much better can we get from that? It, it just blows my mind how, like, enter entertainment has evolved so far. Like, it's it's just like, what the fuck is going on in the anime world right now? I guess I can end this. I, like, I don't even know how to end this. Like, I'm going to finish off with the last topic. There's a release date for Choo Choo Charles. I don't know if you guys remember this, but in a specific Dead Space video, I mentioned Choo Choo Charles because I saw a video of it on TikTok. This dev was solo working on this game for about i think a year and a half two years and at first it already looked this dev has been putting in that work he's talked about how he's been like ever since he's posted that video how it changed how he's developed the game and everything and honestly it's just it's just good to see him like put in that work because usually with like indie devs like of course all, all respect in the world to indie devs like when have you seen an indie dev make a scary game when have you seen an indie dev make a horror game like the only thing that comes close is maybe like what hollow knight but that's not even like technically horror like what can we even say but i'm happy about it it has a release date finally we're definitely gonna play because i but i can't wait bro oh we have so many games coming out in the next like week and a half like we had the Choo Choo Charles. Callisto Protocol comes out in a couple of hours, actually. But sadly, I won't be able to upload that until uh, tomorrow, later on in the day. And also, holy shit, we had the quintessential quintuplets movie. W's in the fucking chat for that. I don't know, man. <laughs> Life is, is getting really exciting. We'll, we'll see how everything turns out. But all right, guys. I hope you have a good one. Keep grinding. I'm on the last sniper until I have to do my right shield. And then from here on out, it's just the pistols and the knife, really.
I hope you guys enjoyed. Subscribe, like, comment. Say hi to your grandma. Have a good one.